papers. Blooming green keepers. You, you get here early, first thing in the morning, think, I'll just start a nice little video for everybody. And they gotta arrive and be noisy. Thank you very much, mate. No, no, you're a star. Gotta, gotta, gotta make it look the best. Absolutely. Without green keepers, we don't play golf. But it's, it's just a big thing that every time I go and film anywhere, <laughs> green keepers are there in the background being noisy. Thank you, mate. We're off. So, slightly impromptu start. Welcome, welcome to Big Oggy Golf. Today, I am at St. Austell Golf Club, if you haven't recognized it already, and it's looking fantastic. The weather is gonna be amazing, and it's a very special day, because it's the Motor Neurone Disease Association Cornwall Branch Charity Golf Day. And uh, I've got three other buccaneers coming to take part. Uh, we've paid to take part today, and I'm gonna make a little diary film just to kind of show you what happens. I can't stay the whole day. We're starting first thing in the morning and this is going to go until about eight or nine o'clock tonight with your presentation, but just want to come and do a little video to kind of showcase some of what happens today and to give the uh, charity a bit of promotion. So we've got an early morning tea time, 9.07. Green keepers are still working hard on the course as always. Place is filling up. About 130 golfers plus today are actually going to take part in this event. It's a scramble, which I'm very pleased about because quite frankly, I don't know if I'm actually going to be able to swing a club much at all. Um, but it's going to be a long day for everyone. So we're out early. That way we get our lunch at a reasonable time. It's just a little diary video today. Let's go and see who our team is. Because they are actually practicing. They're practicing on the putting green. They're taking it seriously. Hang on, is it? Hang on. Uh, what? First of all, what are you doing? Why are you practicing? You don't do that in our. I battle. know. Just get um, used to the greens. And secondly, why are you practicing putt to about sixty foot? We don't hit it close. No. Welcome, Neil. Hello, John. Uh, Neil Allen, by the way, everyone knows already. All right. Uh, take your part today as one of the uh, Buccaneer team, I guess we could call ourselves. Um, also playing is. Nick Cooper, you've seen him on channel Hello. regularly recently. They do say beware the injured golfer, but they don't say beware the golfer who feels like shit. Exactly. But, uh, none of, none of we'll see. He hasn't learned, does he? He hasn't learned. <laughs> First two minutes in the video. <laughs> yeah. Um, so uh, Neil's Neil got very as well. Neil's got a little injury. Neil's got a problem with his thumb. And Nick feels like death. Uh, John Evil will see in a second. Uh, he's recovering from COVID from two days ago, and I've slipped my disc. I'll be back. We <laughs> We're not here we to win it, it, lads. We're in it to win it. <laughs> yeah. Hello. Hello, Mr. Evo. We've got to be quiet because we're by the first tee. There it is. You ready for this? Of course. Of course. I'm, I'm always ready. I'm glad one of us is. Always ready. John Evo, by the way. Hello. Mr. Specsavers, Mr. Moustache. Good. Great, great to see you back on the channel, mate. Thank you. It's nice so, to be um, back. Yeah. So, do you think we've got a chance today? We've always got a chance. Yeah, we got, we've got, got no hope or Bob out, mate. I think well, we've got a chance. No, 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 no. Um, Gotta be positive. We'll be positive. Good morning, everyone. Morning. Okay. Yeah, we're on the first tee, gentlemen. We on um, Southwest. Oh no, I'm, I'm just a YouTube channel, sorry, oh, mate. Right. But you know, I'm infamous, honestly, infamous. So I have got a driver in my hand. Although what I'm going to be swinging a club on this is another matter. I'm hopefully not, gentlemen. All right. I'd like to just probably swing a club on the short par threes. That's the very short par threes. <laughs> Our problem is, do we let Neil go first and then we don't have to do anything? Or if he hits a bad one, we're all suddenly in trouble straight away. Well, there is, there is that. There are some very long holes, or quite tricky long holes, which Neil will be needed later. So it's three drives each, I believe, gentlemen, minimum. We will crack on. Straight and left is good here, Nick. Straight and left will be fine. Straight and left? Straight or left. Don't go right. That's a Well, you went right. You'll be in that kind of rough stuff on the right. Yeah. Oh. So much for Mr. Dependable. Yeah. First shot out. You should have practiced your actual drives, mate, not the putting. I think you're right. Go on, John. Get us out of here, mate. Oh. 
That's all right, John. Better to be left. Well done. That's be fit, sorry, channel. There's been no real actual warm up. Ah, you do realise that now means I've actually got it to drive, don't you, lads? Thanks for that, everybody. Thanks for that. Sorry, right, John. I didn't even see where that went. You were bobbing along this. I don't even know if it will bend. Right. Right, Teed. Right. Yeah. We'll find one of them. That's lovely, John. That's right at it. That's up there. Well, that's probably pretty good too. I know I'll show the height on that with this little camera, but <laughs> right now, is there a point in me swinging? Probably not. Too far to the right. Well, there's at least two of you out there, isn't there, lads? Do you need me or not? I can't bend, you can forget it. <laughs> Stop making rules. Irons will be done later. Right. So, John is went up the back there. Neil is on the green. Well done, Neil. Thank you, John. Um, I can see now why you practice long putts. Exactly. exactly. Yeah. You're used to us on our scrambles now, aren't you? Everything's a blooming long putt. I can't hit it close half the time. Let's right. see how we get on. What did we say as per last time? Don't leave it short. Don't leave it short. Well. Very good, Neil. Well done. Don't leave it short. That's fine. That's very good, that's all right. Well, we'll take a four on here today, and if we get a three, that'll be miraculous. Foot off the right, John. It's about, if you hit it with my pace, it's about there, I think. That looks very good, John. Very good, John. Good effort inside me. Off the right. Foot off the right. Yeah. If you hit it with a big pace, six inches, John, but make sure you, you know, go. Yeah, too far off the right. Is that right? That's kind of nice. Yeah. Not what a bad putt. Not what a bad putt. Yeah. I'm, I'm, here, I'm here for the putting, lads, as we know. So, finish it off, gentlemen, and then we'll go and play a few holes and then get back on this video later. Okay. Not a bit of market, I suppose. Just in case. <laughs> Well done. We'll take a four. No doubt. See you in a while, everybody. I wasn't going to film anymore, but I just want to quickly nip on because you just said that that was your hole, didn't you, John? Well, nearly. Wasn't quite you nearly, nearly stole nearly, the hole. Nearly yeah. stole the hole. Three shots out of four, though, mate. Yeah. Brilliant. Well done. This, this is a hole in one hole. We won't be showing it because that's some greatness. Oh, Look at that. Be positive. Be positive. Come on. I am positive. Or am I O negative? I don't remember. One six one. It says on the car. So, John, we're on the long par three. Four pole. Um, 
we've got to be quick but the lads are just going to find their ball that he lost mine end up on the fairway dribbling down ish yours oh you're within uh, three feet at that mate well done This man today, without him, we'd be in serious trouble so far, wouldn't we, lads? Yeah, he's done pretty good. So, Neil? Nine holes down. Nine holes down. Pretty good so far. We're not doing too bad. Yeah, um, we've, um, we haven't really messed any holes up. No, no, I think we're, what, we need one bogey, three birdies. One bogey, um, three birdies. That's five pass, so. Yeah, pretty good. We're not doing too bad. Yeah, yeah. Um, one decent putt by me. Yeah, Save the day. I've managed to get one drive in now. We've 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 done pretty well. We sort of blended together nicely. You've had some nice shots. We've all we've all. Three. Johnny Evers, shot. Yeah, yeah. We one are. of the, the trickiest trickiest par threes here. Two hundred odd yards. John goes and sticks it. What's the next one? Six to eight feet. Something like that. I will say, Mister Evers not here at the moment. He just drove the buggy. Yeah, he has been playing like on he's fire. He's on isn't fire, isn't he? Yeah. yeah, yeah. He's doing really well. Right from the start. Yeah, so yeah. No, he's doing well. Um, so he nearly got that. Well, he got two. Yeah, on yeah, that, on that long par three, that's a tough par three yeah. with that out of bounds on the right. So, um, having a good day. The yeah. weather is stunning. The weather is, weather is fantastic. It's, yeah, it's, it's not too hot. No, there's a little breeze there to keep it cool. Just a bit more suntan lotion needed now. I think so, a bit of a top up and a bit, yeah. of, a bit of a drink. We've got a little gap between us while we're waiting for um, the next lot to come through. Yeah. So, um, we'll grab a drink and we'll probably see them sometime. Where are we going to see them here on the channel? About 13, 14? Yeah, something like that, yeah. But no, the uh, course is playing well as well. Yeah, and hopefully they're raising a lot of money for the Mountain Your Own charity today because it's, it's a terrible disease. I'm, I'm a rugby fan, and obviously yeah. I know the Doddy Weir charity and uh, the, uh, oh, what's the other one? One that Kevin Sinfield does oh, a lot yeah, of stuff yeah. for. Yeah. Um, so, yeah, it's a, it's a serious issue, this. That's a great shot, John. So boomer got a little bit left. It's gonna be good. Right now, so we're obviously just another group yeah. sitting up behind. How are we getting on? We're doing all right. We've got all our drives in, which is good. Um, we're on sixteenth. Yep. Not playing too bad. A lot of pars. Yeah. Need some. Need a couple of we're birdies now. Win, but need some birdies on this last few. Okay, so we're going to play the sixteenth with a teeny tiny par three. One of those ones you think you should get a birdie on, but quite frankly, it's tougher than you think. Oh, that'll be all right. We can find a chip in the pocket. Off the next hole, next to us. As I said, not a lot of golf to show you on this video because, well, we're all in the competition and it takes time to video and stuff. All kind of there and thereabouts. This is probably the quirkiest hole on the course, to be honest. I love it. Mm -hmm. Up and oh, they're all looking. Can't tell. Can't tell. Okay. Yeah, Nielsen. Quite an awkward little par three. It's not very long. A little small green as well. Obviously struggling with his back problem, but as long as I manage to get in three drives, I don't really care. And I have managed to do a few putts. So that was all I expected today. Just here taking part, enjoying the day in a beautiful sunshine. It's a fabulous day. They have been blessed with a probably brilliant day for them. And I hope they raise an awful lot of money. So a bit earlier on the channel, 
we said on the video we said about other motoring your own charities obviously uh, Rob Burrow Rob Burrow the one where Kevin Sinfield is doing all the work for so hopefully this one today will raise a lot of money too let's go and see where we ended up so as befits how tough this little hole really is that's currently the nearest the pin over there oh, okay. so we're going to take Nils John's ended up down the slope Nick's ended up probably somewhere in the rough stuff over there and mine was a bit on the short side but we'll go for the putt Uh, Neil's been very professional. This why he's practicing the long putts earlier today. I will say he's been doing very well with his putting today. Going back to his old putter. <laughs> and there we go. That, I didn't kiss the deaf I was thinking, should I just said that and put the pressure on him? Uh, well done. Well done, Neil. You need to get a little trophy cabinet for your sink. Yeah, yeah, just, yeah, just put your sink know, away. Yeah. Yeah, I need a wardrobe <laughs> like you. Yes, Narnia. So, Narnia. So what are you? Uh, what are you using now, Neil? Just let me trust. Gone back to the two ball ten. Yeah, always been um, a trusty weapon in your hand. Slant, arm, slant neck rather than the in hosel neck. Okay. In head neck, but working at the moment. Yeah, you do swap occasionally from the sink putter to this one. Yeah, that one's going to be uh, banished for a little while. Well, it'll be back. It'll be back. It'll be back. Let's crack on to the next hole. Well done. <laughs> Get a bit tired now, aren't we, Neil? You've hit some big drives today, though, mate. And, and hit some great putts. Mentally. Mentally gone. Yeah, that's pretty good, no, mate. That's not too bad. I don't think it's too bad. Oh, you got me again. Uh, how many times? You didn't hit it again, mate. I know. <laughs> <laughs> didn't hit it. Didn't hit it. Ah, oh, retired, mate. He didn't say the same as me. Same as you. Oh, if only I played the same as you all the time, mate, I'd be laughing. Big finish, John. Inside the hole. You got it. No. Oh. No. How'd that happen? Well, that's golf, mate. Yeah, what can I say? Looked all the way as it was in. That one did. Well done. Thank you very much, gentlemen. There you go. So, hope you enjoyed that little video we've created today. We are actually on the uh, range here at St. Hostel because it's the coolest place to be right now. It is. We um, had a little spot of light lunch after. We did. And, uh, um, very nice dessert. I've got a picture of the dessert. It was, uh, it was nice. White chocolate lemon parfait, I believe, with raspberry sauce and it was cream. Perfect. Parfait. It was very good. Uh, so, the, the course is still rammed. The car park mm -hmm. is jammed solid. I've taken a yeah. little bit of B roll of that. You don't know, but I have. This course will be rammed until about five o'clock tonight. I think they've yeah. got 130 plus golfers taking part in this event. And I'm hoping they're going to raise a serious amount of money. I'd say, yeah, that, that is, it's so nice to see a charity day being supported that well. Oh, absolutely. You, know, you think 130 odd play, people playing. Most bought raffle tickets as yeah. well. So we will. the money coming in is going to be fantastic. Yeah, I'll, I'll hopefully I will find out. I've spoke to Catherine, the manager here, and she hopefully will give me the details later on, but yeah. we're not going to stay till whatever time that'll be tonight to finish because no, no. we are shattered uh, our other two lads have already gone off home yeah uh, john sort of was struggling with covid until a few days ago and he's on his recovery yeah uh, nick's not very well at all and, and thank you very much nick to be here today he played well considering oh they both played, well without john and nick <laughs> well, yeah, we'd have been all over the place wouldn't we uh so we didn't get a chance to film an awful lot of golf no. but that really wasn't what this was about this was about the fact we're going to showcase how lovely St. Ostel is and a few of the pictures. Uh, what a fantastic job they've done of helping organise this today. And obviously, 
to try and raise money for the uh, Motor Neurone Disease Association yeah. Cornwall branch, yeah. I believe is what they are. Uh, it, it's a, a, a terrible condition and uh, I, I said it's one of those things that frighten me to death if I ever get it uh, and I hope I don't yeah so if you can please give any money uh, I'll try and find a link to the Cornwall Association or the actual National Association if you want to donate some money there'll be a link below um, what else do we need to say well I think really it's, it's just, just to showcase charity days as well yeah um, I mean you've done done yours and um, I think it's always good just to Put your hand in your pocket a little bit. It's not all about serious golf. It's not all about no, no. winning. It's having a good day, and it's just it's about serious golf. Why are you watching this channel? To be honest, exactly. Yeah, but no, it's, it's about raising the money for for causes. So, yeah, I think if you've got one at your golf club or one near you, enter it. Have a bit of fun. Yeah, I mean, we played a scramble. We played a scramble format. We played a scramble format. It was very relaxed. Yeah. What did we end up? Um, I think we ended up two under. under or something like that with yeah. less our ten shots we had. So. 12 under which yeah but very happy bad. very happy really um I, i've said it before on channel i'll say it again being a youtuber being obviously working on social media with neil and, and myself it's not about making loads of money we're not making loads of money out of this seriously i wish we were uh it's about raising awareness for events like this that's it um so i love coming to these different events whether they be local golf events that are having a charity base or more of a national one like this or a, a bigger charity. Exactly. Um, if you want me to try and come and take part in some of these events, I will. If Neil's available, he will. Um, but please, just just get involved with your local golf club. And uh, if they're doing any kind of captain's charities or whatever, take part. Take part. Give a bit of money back. Yeah. Help the community. That's what we're here for. So, we're going to get going. Thank you very much for watching the diary. If this goes out, well, I hope it goes out, Next week, you and I are at the Point Pulse F. We are. We are weather indeed. permitting. We've had a yeah. few attempts to try and get to the point, and the weather has always kind of beaten us before we got there. And today is blue sky. If it's um, like this. Baking. However, I did look at the weather report, and it's not looking good. No, no be, behave. It'll be fine. Uh, it'll just be a two-man uh, match, scramble, whatever in the play. Yeah, we haven't decided. We'll, we'll work out when we get there. But uh, thank you very much to the point, and thank you very much to St. Austell for allowing us to come and film today. Bye, everybody. We're going to grab that camera before it blows off that little, tiny, narrow... I know. The base. Not much of a, a base, no. but it will do. Bye, everyone. Speak soon.